Good morning. I hope everyone's having a great day. You know, for many of you, you know that my passion is taking care of our future generation, our youth. Since 1985, I've had a statewide kids program where I visit schools. The kids will write an essay on why proper nutrition and exercise will put more quality in their life. And I'm here with one of the winners from Harrison High School, and his name is Robert Newsom. Good job. You practice what you are, you are what you eat, and so if you, you, know, you take in unhealthy foods, you're going to get unhealthy um, results. It's never too late, so stand up now, take advantage of what you have now, go out, exercise, and live a healthy life. When it comes to strength training in our kids, the benefits are endless. Let's take a look. A child can work out with weights strength training from the age of eight years old and up but always have supervision. The buddy system works. A child should never lift more than 15% of their body weight until they're 15 years old. All movement should be done seated or lying down. A child should never lift weights over their head. And always wear a weight training belt to protect your lower back. The medical benefits to our youth to start an early strength training program is myriad. You can decrease your incidence of cardiovascular disease, you can decrease your incidence of type 2 diabetes, you can decrease your incidence of obesity. Just a thought, the average child from 6 to 12 is 5 pounds overweight. It doesn't need to be that way. We as parents, we need to live it so that our children look at us like TVs and understand that proper nutrition and exercise is going to put more quality in our lives as we get older. Until next week, I'm Peter Nielsen with Peter's Principles.